Game of the Week. The 2014 regular season comes to a close this week, and all playoff spots have been decided. But there are plenty of good games remaining. Among them are PB Game Time Game of the Week between Seminole Ridge and Royal Palm Beach. Good, good. I'm here at Seminole Ridge, where the Hawks are getting ready to play the playoff-bound Wildcats. Now let's send it out to Anthony. I'm here at Royal Palm Beach High School with head coach Willie Bueno. The Wildcats won the district title last week. Coach, what's the goal this week after winning the district title? Well, to continue to improve and, and play well. Obviously, it's our homecoming this week, and we don't want to let all the distractions of homecoming, uh, you know, kind of distract us, obviously, and, and go out and play well Friday night. How do you prepare for a running game like Seminole Ridge has where they use two dynamic backs and Jalen Young and Kareth White? You know, our run fits, we're going to have to fit in uh, where, we, uh, where we're supposed to on defense and uh, obviously uh, keep the ball from going north and south and, uh, and, and get a lot of hats to the football and, and, and tackle kind of like what we've been doing all year against the run. I feel like we've been defending it well. So, Thanks, Coach. Let's go to Jody at Seminole Ridge. Here with Seminole Ridge coach Scott Barnwell. Coach, you've had an up and down season, but you've won your last few games. How important is that momentum going into this game on Friday against Royal Palm Beach? Well, anytime you play Royal Palm Beach, you know you're in for a dogfight. Um, they're probably one of the best teams in this county, hands mm -hmm. down. Uh, their defense is phenomenal. I, I don't know if I could tell you the last time that they've punted. What's the key going to be? Again, you said they have a great defense, a great offense. How do you stop them? Well, you know, we have a good rushing game, so the only way to kind of hurt us is to keep us off the field. Um, so we're going to do our best to run the ball, and uh, hopefully uh, that'll keep them off the field. Coach, thank you so much. You're welcome. Anthony, what's this week's skills challenge? In this week's skills challenge, we will test the accuracy of each team's punter. Each punter will have five opportunities to hit the coffin's corner, or in this case, a target placed 30 yards away. The punter who comes close to hitting the target on the fly wins the challenge. Representing Royal Palm Beach will be punter Devin Wallace. Devin, how often do you practice something like this? During the week before a game, maybe two, three times a week. For someone who hasn't punted before, how hard is it to kind of get it close to target that size? It's pretty hard, not gonna lie. How confident do you feel going into it? Pretty confident. Jody, who will be representing Seminole Ridge? I'm here with Seminole Ridge defensive back Shaquille Bussey, who's filming in um, for punter for this week's skills competition. Shaquille, have you ever punted the ball at an, in a game before at any level? No, ma'am. Have you ever punted the ball in practice at any level? Yes, ma'am. What kind of techniques do you use to, to aim it to where you want it to go? I don't know. I don't have no technique. I just kick it. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Shaquille. <laughs> All right, Devin, congratulations, you won the challenge. Now, you won the district title just a couple days ago. Now you won the challenge. How good have these last couple days been for you? Been pretty great, not gonna lie. It's probably one of the most exciting feelings ever. Uh, show, us your, show us a smile. <laughs> All right, thanks, Devin. Let's pick some week 11 games. For my PB Game Time Game of the Week pick, I like Royal Palm Beach to be Seminole Ridge 29 to 16. Who do you have, Anthony? I like Royal Palm Beach to beat Seminole Ridge 28 to 14 in this week's game of the week. For my other two picks, I like Glade Central to beat Pahokee 31 to 20 in the Muck Bowl. And finally, I like Wellington to beat John I. Leonard 42 to 21. Who do you have, Jody? For my other two picks, I like Boca Raton to get by Palm Beach Lakes 21 to 20 and Palm Beach Guards to beat Palm Beach Central 20 to 16. Take it away, Anthony. That's it for this week's Game of the Week video. Thanks for joining us this season. Make sure to follow PB Game Time as we begin our postseason coverage. The winner's interview, take one and three, two, one. All right, Devin, you won the job. <laughs> for my Game of the Week pick, I like Royal Palm Beach to beat Seminole Ridge 29 to 16. Who do you have, Anthony? Ugh, the hair. Ugh.